Excuse the workout equipment, a uh, workout fit, but it is workout day. However, I decided um, this just idea just kind of came to me the other day that I should do a music um, inspiration uh, segment ever so often. And so today I'm going to be highlighting this wonderful, amazing song because what a lot of people don't realize is music is not just music, music is ministry. And so this song that you hear playing right now. It actually, um, I was going through homelessness, a little story time. I was going through homelessness and I was living in, in Chicago, Illinois, and I was wrestling, like Jacob wrestled, wrestled with the angel of the Lord. I was wrestling with the decision of whether or not I was going to continue to stay there and struggle, or if I was going to move to Minnesota like my family kept kept trying to encourage me to do and so I finally made the decision to move and when I was on the bus um, headed to Minnesota I was pregnant with my youngest son and I had my daughter who was born right before him Naomi in a car seat and I remember praying and asking God to give me a sign I know that there's scripture that talks about um, the generation that asked for a sign but I am the one that asked for the sign I prayed I said God I just need um, confirmation that I'm supposed to be moving here and this song came on and when she was singing it wasn't just singing it was ministry to me because it gave me that peace in knowing that I was in a season of breaking but God was doing it gracefully so that he can use me more and so if this song has ever inspired you or if you have a song that has encouraged you put it in the chat section put it in the comment section so that you can inspire someone else okay let's go work out talk to you soon Excuse the baby pooch. This is how I'm gonna lose it. Glory be to God. Let's work out. And this little foot move is called You Can't Touch This. Use the open hands and wash the form. I'm really like that. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And always dream big.